Yo guys, look at my jet! This is a heavy jet with multiple mechanics like landing gear and harpoon. But this is still stable. Look at this! Alright! Hey guys, what's up, what's up? This one is a simpler jet mechanics. I actually saw this in Lava Flow's video with the helicopter. But I will add more tips for you guys. So you can enjoy this even more. So let us start now. By the way, you have a separate save slot for this so you can simply put these mechanics to your other jets. So place 5 blocks, delete the first 4, scale to 24, with scale 2, scale both sides one time. With move 1, place the hinge like this. And here too! And also here! Place block on the hinge, then scale. Same on the other hinge. Scale this one time. You can use any jet turbine. Place jet turbine here. Place jet turbine like this on both sides. By default, switch jet force to red. And for testing, place pilot seat. Yes, it flies really well, guys! Now I added propeller mechanics to make this heavier. Guys, this one is without the hinge. Very unstable! Keeps going down! Ah! Now this one with the hinge. See? Very stable! Awesome, right? And just to show you, this what will happen if you don't adjust the jet force. <laughs> this goes crazy. Ah! So make sure to adjust, okay? But this thing can do barrel roll. So you can also place the seat like this. With this, you can do barrel rolls. But the disadvantage of this is that it doesn't look good when you place it on the cockpit like this. <laughs> Looks like a casket, right? But years ago, I already had a solution for this. Make a fake pilot. <laughs> what? Then the seat will be hidden inside the jet body. I did this to my easy jet. I call this easy because it is easy. <laughs> a full tutorial here in my channel. But this doesn't have any flight mechanics yet. So yes, I can do barrel roll. But it is very unstable. Because of some mechanics like the landing gear, the harpoon. By the way, with fake pilot, this still can fly in first person mode. Oh, you're right. Cool. So to attach this to the jet, I delete this seat because my jet already have one. Place this under the jet must be centered. I bind the jets to the original seat of the jet. You can move the mechanic so that it is at the center of the jet when assembled. Then place a piston here. Press the piston. By the way, if needed, you can add more pistons if you want. Adjust the mechanics. Make sure this part of the piston is attached properly to the jet. You can use block to attach this. Make sure these mechanics will not touch other blocks, okay? Bind this piston to a switch. I call this assemble piston and assemble switch. Now save and reload. And to fly this, uncheck anchor first, of course. Ooh. Press the assemble switch. Now we can fly. But with the red jet force, this what happens? I think the jet is too heavy, especially with its mechanics. So with that, you need to adjust the jet force based on your build. You can experiment with this. Just find the sweet spot for your jet. So in my case, I adjust mine just one time. See this guys? It is now very stable. Cool, right? Although with these mechanics, you are not really in the cockpit. It's the fake pilot. <laughs> So yeah, this is much simpler. I can still say that this Lava Flow's jet mechanics is still better and more complete. By the way guys, if you are not yet subscribed, please subscribe now and click the notification bell. Please like and share the video. Guys, I hope you learned something. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye!